Still got a ways to go. Where are you doing, Ryoba? The rebuttal showdown. I think that's what they're called. Oh, really? Fine, then show me the strength of your convictions, Ryoma! <laughs> Thinks I'll go into Wall 1 debate called Rebel Showdown. Yeah, that's it. You encounter the art prison's clear and argue against it. It's the sword fight. Okay, move your blue with all in the line with your opponent's claim. Form a regular cut in the direction of the blade is pulling by pressing X. Cut, the tr cut with the truth blade by pressing triangle. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Truth bullets we called truth blades. Regular cuts in your opponent's words, but a weak spot appears. Slash it with a truth blade. Of course, if you have the correct truth blade, you won't be able to cut opponent's remark. But as news, you can cut through multiple words at once. You got time bonus. Two ones are two threads. Three is three. The more you cut, the better. The position of your opponent's claim closely and slice it as many as you can. Yeah, you can screw the debate's mood to your advantage. Moods of the iron is in favor. Yeah, the debate will progress. The other half, you ignore the other person's remarks, it will skew towards their advantage. You have to deal with the loss of progress. Your opponent's arguments are even. A blade lock will occur. Why well, you have to mash X as fast as you can to push them off. This is slicing and dicing onions with a truth sword, the bee's knees. Oh, it sure is, system. What? Not really. Well, you shouldn't knock it before you try it. You also be agree, so if blah, 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 blah. Thanks for your time. Ren Charles Brian confronts Rose. Yeah. Not if they went back into hiding. Right after killing Rantaro. Then, once everyone's gathered around the body, all they gotta do is act like they just ran in. We join everyone and we be none the wiser. I don't think that was the right one, but I got it. It was the right one. Okay, it yeah. from the camera we placed near the front door. This is when Shuichi and I met up with Kaito and Tenko, and then rushed in. Yeah. This one shows the other four people running in after they heard Tenko scream. Okay. And finally, everyone else coming in after hearing the body discovery announcement. All right. You can clearly see everyone entering the library in these pictures. It wouldn't make sense if there was someone hiding in the library the whole time. Yeah. Well, that does cover everyone now, doesn't it? Not unless they're the ultimate ghost. I guess the one who still has a ways to go. Gunto, was the range on your stand exactly? <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's better to think about each possibility anyway. Right, Chuichi? Hmm? Oh, um, Yo, okay, Suichi. He's been really quiet. He's thinking. Is he worried about something? How the culprit entered and exited the library. We cannot continue until we address that problem first. Yeah. It's quite the mystery. How did the killer avoid being caught by the cameras? How did they? You can you cast invisibility? That's still pretty useful. That's kind of a half baked invisibility spell, isn't it? But both doors to library have hidden cameras on them. How about the vent in the library? Maybe they came in through there. 
But Shuichi and I were on lookout in the classroom with the connecting vents. If you're like in a fight and your upper half's invisible, then that's all you really need because they don't know where your weapons and stuff are. <laughs> Yeah. Um, yeah, no. There's no way someone snuck into the library through the vent. We have evidence that proves that would be impossible. She stacked up a crap load of books and no one disturbed them. Yeah, the stacked books! When I set the cameras, I also stacked some books in front of the vent. Look at all these books I stacked! All perfectly stacked. In and out from the, vent, the books would have collapsed. While we were investigating, they were still neatly stacked the way I placed them. But you could roll something out of that vent like that, if like this picture is to be believed. Maybe they put the books back when they left the room. That would be quite difficult to achieve on such a narrow bookcase. If we rolled out the vent and doors. Then how'd the culprits get in and out of the library? How indeed. Divine intervention? Gonta no can think of any other way to enter. Eureka! I know how the culprit got in the library. The front door! Yeah! Um, have you been paying attention? The camera <laughs> would have taken their picture. Not if the culprit timed their movements around the camera intervals. Yeah, that- yeah, okay. Oh yeah, because the film has to wind itself. Yeah. So they snuck into the library between camera shots to avoid appearing in the photos. Yeah, okay. I know, I know. Beauty and brains. Why? It's just not fair. Okay, Mew, that- points it squarely back at you, because only you would have known about that. Yeah. <laughs> well, you and Suichi. Yeah. Because they're designed to his exact specifications. Like, Suichi did know about this, though. Because he, like, brought it up earlier. At least, like, I think he brought it up earlier. Okay, yeah, yeah. Pretty sure he mentioned it. I forgot. What a pitiful excuse. Yeah, that's pretty much a lie. Like, are they talking about the thirty-second interval in particular, or just the fact that they that she set it up so they rewind automatically? Because I uh, know for a fact that Shuichi brought that up. May the interval in particular, like the exact length of time, but. No. going on at the time. It's only natural to forget, you know? Yeah. Let's put that aside for now and talk about the camera intervals. Okay. For 30 seconds, correct, Mew? Yeah, sure. I'll explain it again to you mushheads. Yeah. The three cameras that Kaidiot and Kuichi placed go off when they pick up movement. From there, it takes 30 seconds for the film to auto-roll to the next photo. Yeah. So, for 30 seconds, anyone could have entered the library without their photo being taken? That may have been enough time to kill Lantaro and exit the library. It's definitely enough time! You just gotta move at lightning speed! I see, I see! Then there's no doubt the culprits made use of the camera's intervals. 
That means the culprit was Mew all along, since she knew about the intervals. Don't be an asshole! I have an alibi. Remember the dining hall? Right, yeah. I forgot she does. Uh, well, <laughs> who yeah, who else will have known? Suichi. <laughs> The only problem is, like, why did he set up a system like that in such a way that it would, like, point to himself? You would better speak soon. Your silence only damns you further. That's up already! Did you kill Rantaro? Tang Shuichi, that's not me. Don't tell me you're gonna plead the fifth now. <laughs> Oh man, this is getting good. Oh jeez. Suichi can't be the culprit. Suichi Bye. 